Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to another video on my channel. On today's, we're going to be talking about the Urban or Urban Urban Skin RX cleansing balms. I was going to say balms, just regular. What's up? Welcome. I am Jules Juliet. On today's video, you guys, we're going to be getting details on how to actually use this product because I've been seeing a lot of people use it so incorrectly and I, I just can't anymore. I've learned a lot and I know a lot of you guys are also learning as we go and I just want to go ahead and show you guys some information and some details regarding this product and I'm actually really freaking obsessed with it so far and I love it and I don't know why people are not raving about it but I'm gonna go ahead and give some ravings about it because you guys need to try this out now one this is not sponsored whatsoever because we're not there yet but anyways let's get to this video number one thing that I will ask you and I'm telling you that you do need it and I'm gonna leave the link down below is a silicone brush sponge brush cleanser sponge look it is a silicone like literally it's silicone it has little little beads on it it has for you to insert your fingers however you want either two fingers like this i do the three method like this makes me feel more like i'm having a grip it has for you to put in your nails you know and then you can just go ahead and scrub now it does have two different styles of bristles down here and then down here has more of a softer right here has more like a grittier and then you could also hang it you guys this is a product this is a product that it is a necessity necessity to have because one it is so freaking easy to clean and it is the least way of you to have bacteria on the product on the item sorry not the product on the item this is the way that you can be more on the safer side than when it comes with brushes one bacteria stays when you are done with it and the water stays there and then the dust gets in it or just the fact that you may have not clean like cleaned it properly then just bacteria stays in that product so that's something that you always want to avoid is especially when you have prone acne here you want to go ahead and avoid things that can cause you to break out due to bacteria buildup now when you have a silicone brush like this you can go ahead and just wash it with an antibacterial soap let it hang before you use it go ahead and rewash it again the cool thing about this is that it literally just runs off and it's an easier way of cleaning it makes your life a lot easier like yes probably for m many people they don't like the fact that they have to use their hand manually but honestly i prefer it that way i feel like i'm having more control with it so to the start of the show today we're gonna go ahead and talk about these babies right over here how to use them to begin with honestly i really do love both of them i do not use them together although i did before started using them together so i do go ahead and wash my face twice a day if i could do three times i will but i other than that it's twice a day morning and nighttime. now this is like my favorite one it is the clear skin it is the cleansing balm three in one treatment now this one right over here is just basically to lighten up the scars that you have. It is an even tone one. It brightens and improves uneven skin tone. Now, this one is a lot more stronger. But I've seen people use these and double dip in them. Which is not something that you want to use to prevent bacteria because these are a bar. So, what I'm going to let you know is that when you're using the brush... You go ahead and wet it and then once you wet it, shake off the excess water. Then you go in it and go ahead and do about three to four circles. Once you're done, that is it. Go ahead and start using it on your face. Do not whatsoever go in again because that is not okay. Because when you are cleaning your skin, keep in mind that you are exfoliating as well. These little have bristles, so you're going to go ahead and exfoliate all the dead skin cells or all the dirt that you have on your face. And when you double dip in that, it's just you're putting it back in there, which then just kind of spreads because it is a bar and it's, it's just not sanitary for you to do at all. So do not double dip when you are using these bars. I want to say that they're in the affordable side because they're not that expensive and there's a lot of times that you get deals on this one so if there is a deal going on snatch it if not pay full price i honestly paid full price on it one on amazon and one on ulta but honestly you guys it is something that you might want to start incorporating on your skincare to help you just get that nice exfoliation get that nice skin glow and just control your oils and your breaks out now i have not had any acne breakouts in a pretty long time 
other than the ones that I've personally cost and the ones that the mask are currently costing me. But I mean, other than that, you guys, my skin has been doing such a huge improvement. Oh, and the fact that I just had my glory days about three days ago, my acne, that's something that's uncontrollable. But other than that, I want to go ahead and just let you guys know on this product and how to properly use them because I don't want you guys to go over here double dipping. Now, another thing is that this product comes with this, which I would not recommend you using it. Now, use it the first time, then throw it away because when you let this dry, you have, like, if you don't wash this properly, some of the balm and your dead skin cell can be stuck in this thing. And therefore, when you re reuse it again and you dip it in there and then you put it on your skin, it's just, I just believe that it is not as sanitary as you using the silicone. Because the silicone is an easier way to just clean it off, desanitize it, and use it again. And repetitive. You have multiple uses on this than when you have this. It's just, it's just may build up really bad and it's just something that you want to avoid especially if you are prone with acne skin like myself um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and it's a helpful video you guys i love you guys and my room is a really mess and i need to figure out how to keep it clean i swear to you guys when i'm not working my room is clean but when i work i just we just zone out on this i love you guys and i took off my nails because i kind of want to do a new Halloween series of nails. I don't really know yet if I'm there, but um, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.